it's so painful and difficult to see so many white people in the videos that I watch getting knocked out for using the N-word, getting beat up. So often, you know, white people will go to a black person, call them the N-word, and then instantly they get knocked out or beat up. You know how hard that is for me to see? Because I enjoy it so much. I enjoy it so much that it hurts. Oh, I mean, it makes me laugh. It makes me laugh to the point of tears. It makes me so happy <laughs> when I see racist people call black people the N-word and then BAM! Knock the fuck out. Oh, the joy. <laughs> it hurts, the pain, the joy, because it, it, I enjoy it so much. Maybe too much. But you know, white people, if you're racist and you feel the need to call somebody the N-word, it ain't like it used to be. Black people ain't playing no more. They don't take that shit. The only bad thing about it is sometimes they get arrested for assault. That's what I hate. I really honestly wish there was a law, a hate crime bill that says if a white person calls a black person the N-word, automatically they get arrested. They go to jail. Because, you know, like in Germany, they, they ban the swastika. Why can't we ban the rebel flag? and white people from calling the N-word. There needs to be accountability, you know, and there needs to be protection from black people, for black people, so that they don't have to go to jail when they hit somebody for calling them the N-word because there's some words and there's some things that are so historically evil. And the context of that word, because of enslavement of Africans, is so incredibly evil in the meaning it can be. There should be legal accountability for white people who use it against black people. I believe that. But anyhow, white people, once again, <clears throat> be warned. If you're in the habit of using the N-word, you might want to stop that ignorant racist shit and grow the fuck up. Find some fucking humanity before you get knocked the fuck out.